After some light breakfast, we spent the day indulging in the luxuries of the Ritz-Carlton Resort. This hotel has a choice of six pools, including a family pool, pool for children, a serene spa pool and the exclusive adults-only pool, Labai. We spent our afternoon in a private pool cabana sipping on mocktails from the stylish swim-up bar. The perks of staying at this hotel didn't end there as we had access to a secluded private beach reserved exclusively for Ritz-Carlton guests. The poolside menu offers Mediterranean cuisine and this refreshing tuna salad was delicious. After after a late lunch, I headed to the Ritz Spa for some relaxation in the tranquility lounges and a soothing session in the eucalyptus-infused steam room. The hot and cold plunge pools added to the rejuvenating experience. For tonight's dinner, I wore this satin slip skirt and blouse from River Island paired with my favourite mules and my Chanel top handle, which was a piece exclusive to Dubai that I purchased in 2019. Our dining location for tonight is Asia Asia, not far from the hotel. It has beautiful views of Dubai Marina. We ended our night at Smoky Beach for some shisha. The great thing about JBR versus the Palm is that everything is accessible. This spot is literally by our hotel. So when it comes to where to stay in Dubai, your choice between JBR and the Palm will depend on your preferences for atmosphere. If you prefer a lively urban beach scene, then JBR is the spa and for a more secluded beach experience, the Palm is the best place. Our Dubai trip has come to an end and it's time to go home. I chose to wear my favourite Zara shirt dress for the journey back in comfort and style. Stay tuned for my final video with more style inspiration from Dubai.